Come spend the day with me at Gangwagung Palace. First, we headed over to a hanbok rental shop. Here, you can choose your own Korean traditional dress, complete with your skirt and top, and you can combine these in your own unique way. For my gentleman viewers, there's also lots of options for you. After getting dressed by the attendants, they then ushered us over to an accessories table where you can choose the hairstyle you want, and then they will also place some really pretty accessories in your hair. And this is the grand reveal. I chose a really beautiful blue skirt with gold accents throughout my whole outfit. But now that we're all dolled up, up, let's go to the palace and explore. We actually came right on time because the changing of the guards happens every 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. And as you can see, there's so many people streaming in and out of the palace, but the grounds are so huge that it doesn't really feel claustrophobic at all. We strolled around to see everything the palace had to offer, and since it was fall season, there's lots of beautiful trees, including gecko trees, which I think really are an icon of the season. I really think Gyeongbokgung Palace is one of the essential places you must go to if you visit Seoul. But even if you have no plans on going to South Korea, 